And as you can guess, we'll talk about uh, remainder uh, function, another primitive recursive function that we will obtain uh, through uh, bounded minimalization, well, indirectly. Uh, but first, um, a quick uh, answer to a question uh, from uh, one of the students in my uh, uh, theory of computation class. Um, so what is the floor, according to our definition, of the floor of x over y? Uh, what is the floor of x over 0? Uh, uh, and in the previous screencast, we defined this function through uh, bounded minimization. And um, uh, the answer is that it is uh, 0. Uh, by our definition, and that is the difference between the mathematical definition of floor and um, our definition of uh, the floor function. So one of those uh, uh, details that distinguishes computer science from uh, pure mathematics. Uh, so uh, min, uh, a minimization of z less than or equal to x, um, um, so x is less than uh, z plus 1 times 0 is always going to be 0 because uh, z plus 1 times 0 will be 0. So um, let's um, uh, uh, consider another uh, function. Uh, that's the remainder of uh, uh, x and y, x over y, the remainder of the division of x over y. And um, we will show that this function is also primitive recursive, um, and uh, we'll uh, enlarge our repertoire of uh, uh, primitive recursive functions. So as an example, uh, the remainder of uh, uh, 3 and uh, 2 is equal to 1. And uh, uh, the remainder of uh, 3 and um, uh, 10 and 3 is equal to also 1, uh, and that is equal to 10 minus 3 uh, times 3. And the remainder of uh, 8 and uh, 3 is equal to 2. Um, which is equal uh, to 8 minus uh, 3 times 2. So in this um, equality, 1 uh, is the value of the floor of 3 over 2. And in this equality, uh, th uh, 3 is the value of the floor of um, 10 over 3. And uh, 2, in this equality, uh, third example, is the value of the floor of 8 over 3. So these three examples um, give us an insight into how we can uh, actually define this function, the remainder function, and prove uh, that it is indeed primitive recursive. We will compose it uh, from the functions that uh, we have shown uh, to be primitive uh, recursive. Uh, so r of <coughs> x and y uh, is equal to um, x dot minus dot minus um, is the function that we have one of the functions that we uh, showed to be primitive recursive in the previous screencasts um, one of the previous screencasts and dot minus y uh, x dot minus um, y is equal to zero if y is strictly less than x otherwise it's x minus y so it's a safer um, safe um, subtraction so this is primitive recursive and uh, so the remainder of x and y is dot um, minus y, um, uh, x dot, uh, dot minus y times uh, the floor of x and y. The multiplication is also primitive recursive. The floor was shown to be primitive recursive through bounded minimization in the previous screencast. Uh, and uh, um, <coughs> by one of the theorems that we uh, have proved, since um, the remainder of our x and y is obtained um, from the primitive recursive functions by composition, then it is itself a primitive recursive function. And um, <clears throat> by definition, uh, the remainder of x and 0 is equal to 
x dot minus zero times the floor of x over zero which is equal to x.